My hair is getting more ridiculous as the night goes on. I think it's like as it's dried out and I've overcombed it, it's like just gotten like bushy, like stupid. It never looks like this normally. It's just too... It's too fluffy. It's too big. I don't know what I'm going to do. Anyway. Scene three. Is that the right one? Just making sure. I can see my next one there. Okay, cool. Oh, uh, hang on. Make sure it's... All this... I shouldn't be doing this while there's a video running, but, you know. Okay, continue. Previously. Ep episode four, guys. We're going to have to keep it a little quiet because we're heading towards midnight now. People in other rooms are trying to sleep. So just to recap, it's me saving Chloe's life with my time jumping powers. There's the beautiful seaside, there's us hanging out at the diner. Me rebuffing her every sexual advance. Oh. It's me saving a life. Perfect opportunity for a selfie. It's my, one of my proudest moments. I know this isn't pleasant. Good job, Max, for saving that young girl. Tell us everything. Yeah, she, she didn't make it. The thing with the gun, or should we skip all this? I don't know. I feel like this previously on Life is Strange thing will sort of remind me of anything I've actually forgotten that I might need to know. So, so far, though, I remember all this. The files. Files are one of the coolest plot devices you can have in any drama. The files. Give us, the, give me the files. It's like, give me the tape or give me the disc. Give me the files. There's the guy eating the oversized chocolate chip cookie. It's just Frank. fucking around in his Winnebago. So I've read Frank wrong. I thought Rachel was like kidnapped by him or abused or whatever. No. Turns out it might just be a lover's tiff. Ever since he died, my life has been dipped in shit. Chloe, I am awesome. We are awesome. Yeah, not so awesome now, are you? <laughs> Wheels. Hello, are you even listening, Maxine? This is totally fucked Whoa. up. Where else have I changed? Oh, well. Max Caulfield. Hold on. Chloe, you have a visitor. <laughs> I, can't, I still can't believe I, can, I nailed it. All right. Hopefully the game is going to tell me what the fuck happened, because, I mean, I'm assuming there was some sort of tree-climbing accident, or viral meningitis or something. Anything can happen and put you in that state. You've really got to be careful with your bodies. Just this is a bit of a PSA before we get into the game. Um, be delicate with your, you know, your body. It's a finely tuned machine. If you go fucking around with it, bad things can happen. A crab? Kind of weird looking seaside. Oh man, we should blast some Pink Floyd. Or David Gilmore. Kind of fits. Anyway. You know. Um. I get the feeling this isn't skippable. I probably shouldn't try and skip it anyway. Oh. That's touching. It's the bicycle she won't be needing anymore. Now that she's a wheelchair person. Um, man, I'm I'm really quite intrigued to find out what the fuck happened there. Is that a dead whale? Because there was whales washed up on the shore. So we've got dead birds in the gardens, and now we've got dead whales on the seaside. It's all kicking off in Oregon, man. The wildlife is dropping dead. Bernie Sanders needs to get the wildlife to stop dying spontaneously. Life is Strange, episode 4, Dark Room. I might redo all the thumbnails for this series, because at the moment I'm using pictures I did back in, like, August, because that's when I thought I was going to play the game. And so I thought, well, I'll, I'll knock some thumbnails together, take care of it all early, so I don't have to worry about it later. And the joke isn't that funny. It's It involves Clunge, which is something from in between us, which I think is still funny, but as a thumbnail, it's kind of a one-note joke, so I might, I might retouch all of them. Let me know if you have an opinion. Thumbnails, I mean, I, I, I just want someone else to do it for me. I know it can't be David, because, you know, he doesn't care. It's weird hanging out with you again. This is a chore that I don't have to look after. I'm glad we are, though. Anyway, here we are. The story. It was nice that you sent me actual letters. Wow. It's more than any of my other friends have done. Well, they don't... even wrote on that cool parchment paper. It's 
so they don't know you like I know you, Chloe. But I love writing on it like an English poet. And here's a bench, we can sit. Oh. You deserve the best stationery. And the best healthcare the money can buy. Probably easier to write than to visit me. Just a bit. I don't mean that in a bitchy way. Not totally. Mm. You probably wanted to avoid awkward conversations like this. It's a tall wheelchair, she's almost uh, my height. Pretty did, much. Did they make those? Yeah. The worst thing you can do is treat me like a baby. All right. I still want to laugh and talk shit with my best friend. Mm. Can we stop? I'm tired. <laughs> okay. This is serious. normal ableism. I'm just. Uh, I'm still like shocked that I called this development. Let's call that a golden hour. See, without you here, I'd have no clue. Ah. Uh, you could take some amazing shots. Dead whale. Those beached whales are so sad. Don't. People usually try and save whales when they. Uh... At least, I'm alive here with you. Usually in Australia, like when there's whales, everybody just rushes down to the beach and tries to help them. You're a real survivor, Chloe. I know you have to deal with so much. I don't want anybody else feeling sorry for. I'm me. babbling because this is a fucked up development. I can do that. Along with my parents, my dad still feels guilty about buying. Oh, the, the car! The car! Yeah, you can, you can tell me. Are you okay to talk about the accident? We never actually have, huh? There's not much to say. Some prick in an SUV cut me off and I flew into Well, you it. can still move your head. Do you remember everything? I saw everything in bullet time. I felt my back snap and... Wow. And that was the last thing I ever felt in my body. Fuck. When I woke up in the hospital, I literally couldn't move a muscle. This is grim stuff, oh, Jesus. Though. I, I don't know what to say. Don't say anything. I'm just happy I did get to see you again. I could have ended up vanishing out of the blue like that girl from Blackwell. Uh oh. What missing girl played them? What, what missing girl? I don't know her name. I just read about it in the news. I feel bad for her family. This is Man, I'm gonna such get implicated. a different world than when we were kids, isn't it? If I let on that I know too much, no all of a sudden I'll be in... Like like, I think it was me that did it. It might be. It might be, but... I'd like to think we can still change things for the better. I'd like to think that too. Yeah, the I beach isn't as nice it. as you think it is. It's just by standing there, you're getting all this salt water spray on you, and you, you come back home and you're all fucking slimy. It's terrible. I don't feel afraid. <sighs> Hanging out with you makes me feel like a total kid again. You don't even know. Yeah, but back then we used to steal wheelchairs. Now you're actually stuck in one. I'm sorry I haven't been out to see you more. I was wrong. You're my best friend. I'm still a little fuzzy on why this Max chick wasn't in town. Thanks for coming out to see me. Did she live somewhere else or did she just study you're, somewhere? You're what doing was it? awesome. I don't think so. Um, my, my nose is getting cold. Maybe we should get back to my place? Wow. It is hella cold out here. Ah! Uh, Home? I hate that word, no offense. Oh wow. She hates Hella? None taken. Don't take this the wrong way, but the odd spinal injury would do some people a world of good, and I include myself in this. I really whinge too much about little things in life. Could probably use a bit of a perspective adjustment. Um, maybe not that much of one, but... Yeah. All I'm saying is it's a step in the right direction that she's no longer obsessed with the word Hella. I think it's, uh... It's just a shame she had to lose her mobility to reach that stage in her personal development, but personal? Personal development. It's currently 11.22pm. Um, I hope I can stay awake with this whole thing. I'm already kind of feeling a bit tired. I shouldn't have started it. Each episode's what, two hours? Three if you actually explore everything? Hey! Daunting! Alright, here we go. The house does look much nicer since she kept her original husband. And look at that cyborg out the back there, a little droid. Oh, it's a pretty high-tech lair. Whoa! Like a high-tech cell. But I am lucky my parents bust their ass to take care of me. Yeah, how the hell does a person working in a diner afford a hospital bed? They're grateful you are here with them. Right. Especially when they can't even take a walk alone. Sometimes I act like a total teenage brat just to give them an excuse to yell at me. How much of a teenage brat can you be when you're stuck in a fucking unit? Holy. In a life support system. You're kind and sensitive, when you don't even have to be. Trust me, I still get my rage on. 
Especially when a nurse has to watch while I take a dump so she can wipe my bum. Is bum a American word? I've never heard an American say bum. Even imagine. But you're still amazing. Except for when they're talking about hobos. With obvious disdain. Thanks again for coming, Max. Which I feel is a classist way of looking at the world. Can can you bring me some water? Wow. Oh, now what? Now I can do stuff. Huh? I will say this, the room's a lot more disabled safe now. It's got ramps, wheelchairs, snow globes. You want to drink some snow globe? Snow globes are taking over. So now I don't want to dawdle and get stuck looking for the water because, like, it's just it's a different dynamic when there's a disabled person that needs your help waiting on you. Fuck. Alright, open up. Man, Joyce and William built a whole oh, new bathroom for Chloe. I need to get the water for the so great. For my friend, for God's sakes. All right, Jesus, it's making me panic. Drink up, Buttercup. Oh man, no wonder my throat is dry. I don't think I've talked this much the whole year. What are you, an octopus? Thought about doing a Return podcast. me to the sea. A podcast. Punch your face right now. A podcast. Yeah, only losers do. I am a pod in a cast. Boring. Ouch. It was just a thought. Oh, I'd like to actually turn our monthly one into a weekly one if we ever start doing it again, but you know. Yeah, that's become a bad habit of mine. You don't tell anyone. Don't know. It seems like we were kids in another life. Well, what do you remember? What do you remember about us as kids? My hair looks so ridiculous. We all have different memories. It just looks fluffy about like us a wig. little pirates running and jumping through Arcadia Bay. Me too. But we're still pirates in our own way. Uh, yeah, right. Check me out, Chloe of the Caribbean. Well, it's almost like having a peg leg. About now. Unless you're with me. As you can see, I can't keep all my other friends away. Which, which friends? Which friends did you hang out with the most? Megan Weaver, but you don't know her. She was cool. But after my accident, she was too cool for school. I know I wasn't around oh, much. I'm still confused. No. Is she the year above me, or did she drop out? I am trying to make things right. How? Dude, you're not super max. And I'm not trying to guilt trip you. That's what my parents are for. That's an interesting outlook. Are they okay? Are they okay? I mean, are they so happy to go? God, I can't get that Polaroid back and kill her father again. I guess they're good, considering they have to deal with me. We'll find a Polaroid of Chloe in her car and just go back and say, like, look, take the corners a bit slower. Joyce and William are incredible. Max, the accident has been so hard on them. Our insurance sucks and the medical bills are fucking insane. So now we've definitely got a reason to steal money. Can they pay all the bills? Using my time drive. Away. They keep the numbers away from me, but it doesn't take much research to find out I'm costing my parents almost a million dollars a year. Woo! <laughs> You're priceless. They've got to sell a lot of eggs and bacon to their fucking diner to pay for that shit. No pun intended. <laughs> you are such a geek. They're always trying to push more food on the people that eat there. You sure you would not like another omelet? Please! See, I'm practically a human entertainment system. Belgian waffles. It would be sweet to chill out together and watch a movie like when you'd spend the night at my house. <laughs> what do you want to watch? Nothing sad. Uh, I think I'm in like a, a mellow Blade Runner mood. Who I'm cries in the Blade Runner? Are you drunk? Plus, you know, I always wanted to have cool colored bangs like Pris. I know. You would look incredible with blue hair. Now let's get this show on the road. And you better not fall asleep on me like you always do when we watch movies. I remember Max. <laughs> Max falls asleep hugging her and she no accidentally matter. sits on the oxygen tube. <laughs> anyway. Sorry, I'm <laughs> you got to understand, it puts me in the position where I'm sitting here playing this and I have to say stuff that, uh... I can't just get sucked into the game and not do anything. Maybe I shouldn't even be doing a, doing a playthrough of this fucking game, I don't know. What do you think? Oh, your numbers aren't too good, Chloe. We might need to take you in. <laughs> Alright. What am I doing? Max, it is so cool that you're here again. Uh, yeah, sure. I'm glad you think so. Go through your junk. Despite everything... They're still a happy family. It's cool that in this reality, Chloe really loves skating too. I reckon she could take some serious ramps if we if we tune up the engine of that thing there. Give it a little rocket. Alright, what am I doing? This 
Game needs an objective button. Oh, okay. DVD player. Oh, hang on. Search. Ta da! Oh my god. I made that mix for her when we were 12. Pirate power. <laughs> Just in case you couldn't discern these characters, this encrypted message. Ugh. Reflux like a motherfucker. Alright, well, put, put the fucking thing on then. Uh, here's the DVD. Aha! <laughs> this game is going to change the way I talk to myself in my head. First of all, there's going to be a lot more echo and a lot more acoustic guitar going. Doo -doo -doo. And yeah, I'm going to be like, aha! Scotty wins. I'm already like that, though. Don't tell anyone. Oh, ta da. How can they afford Blade Runner? Yep, there certainly is two girls watching a film together. Ooh, Chloe, I think you need your nappy changed. Oh, I'm sorry. Oh, my friends, this sucks! Do I get to fix the timeline? Oh, well, you can't tell me until I've already finished the game. That's how this is going to work. Because I'm going to play the fifth part tomorrow, maybe. And this won't be up for a while, because we have so many other videos to put up. Everything's out of sequence at the moment, by the way, guys. I'm still putting up stuff from the night where we were drinking vodka. we are still got a, a bomb game video to put up, even though I'm pretty sure we're all tired of that by now. Um, our channel's so disorganised. Oh, I hope I didn't block the oxygen tube like I joked about before. <gasps> Max! <coughs> Get off the tube! Oh, Chloe, you're still here? Yeah, I'm still here. Insensitive bitch. I cannot believe you fell asleep so fast. How dare you. I know you were beat down after the day with me. And Blade Runner is a pretty dreamy movie to watch at night. Hang on, I get to get a total recall whenever people say Blade Runner. You know what? I don't think I've ever actually watched Blade Runner. I can see you're not the whole film. No. I'm sorry. I might have to just do it. So hard. Were you okay? Yeah, that's fine. I do have another Infado when you're not falling asleep on me. <laughs> you are a bitch in the morning. It's the company I keep. We're gonna get to the- Yesterday was- We're gonna get to the meat, the point of this conversation? It was great, seeing you. I know things were different when we were just dorky kids, but- See, Being it's an alternate you... reality and stuff. Instead of blue hair, she's got a blue thing sticking out of her throat. Apples and oranges, guys. Just to chill out with you and, and bullshit. <sighs> Fuck. Um, I'm getting my regular head pains. Uh, can you oh, no, 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 no. Don't have somebody's my, my physical comfort based on me finding painkillers. It's, uh, it's total Star Trek shit. You can't even see the needle. Seriously, I, I need it. Um, my parents keep the swag upstairs because they think I can't get to it. But you can, Max. Like a pirate, right? Oh no, oh, I don't like where this is headed. I'm gonna come back and she's dead. Or I'm gonna give her the thing and it'll, it'll kill her because she'll overdose. Even if I successfully find it, it's gonna take me way long to find it because I'm so shit with puzzles. And she's in there suffering. Shut the fuck up, William. This is your fault, you shouldn't have bought us a big fucking dorkmobile. Why is Victoria texting me that cow? Let's find out. SMS. Oh. No. No! Victoria. Max, you may have silence. Wait, what? What about. Ooh, Taylor, here's the one I want. Cry like a bitch. Oh, whatever. Okay, quick. Let's find that morphine thing. Let's save a life. Oh, come on, what are we doing? I know what you're thinking, but this, it's a serious improvement from that fuck den that we walked into last time. Crutches? When did she... she'd never need them. Too bad Joyce and William can't get any help from the Prescott Foundation. Well, that's a good idea. So use your time drive to... I keep calling it time drive like it's something she wears around a belt. <laughs> they bought crutches for Chloe. Hoping she might walk again. 
Now I can use them to elicit the sympathy of passers-by. Collect a few donations for all. I kind of want to open this and see what's my friend. Shoes. <laughs> Chloe always did love stomping around in her boots. I bet she did. Shoes. <laughs> Chloe always did love stomping around in her boots. I bet she fucking did. Shoes. Chloe always did love stomping around in her boots. Okay, enough of that. I never heard much about William's brother. Is he alive? A bigger check. Oh, money. Money is nobody's favorite thing. Yeah, all right. Excuses, excuses. I'm not gonna sit down. My friend sent me up here for a fucking purpose. I think. Wait, did she? Should I even be in this room? Is this where the, the stuff is? I guess we stopped growing up together. Alright, yeah, okay, don't get too carried away. If this isn't the room, then I'm leaving. I didn't come up here to fucking reminisce. I'm on a mission. Alright. Alright. Lock those doors, try the bathroom? Nope. Oh, there you go. Ta da, switch. <sighs> Got it. Alright. Cabinets! Aha! The bathroom looks almost the same. This game should be Robert Baratheon. More medicine. Living the life of a teenage teenage girl. Alright. Open up my cabinet. Here it is. Dunno. I never thought I'd be delivering morphine to my best friend. Get down. I'm getting tense now. I feel like this game's gonna try and throw me another curveball. I don't like it. Go, go, go. Fall down the stairs. It's quicker that way. Alright. I can get past William without him trying to talk to me. What a dick! His fucking daughter is. Anyway. So. What is up with my digestive tract today? I haven't even been eating or drinking anything. Strange. I might be on the way out, guys. This is it. Alright, close. Close my stuff. There's your boy. Finally. Uh, give me the blue pill. I'm sorry. I'm nosy, but not precise. Go ahead and plug it right in. It's so easy. Don't use the word painless, for God's sake. Okay, but get ready to yell for your folks if I screw up. Oh, trust me. I will. Oh no, what's going on? Time drive. Get ready to do it. Of course, my pain just keeps getting worse. But you caught me on a good day. Max, I'm so grateful that I'm... No, 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 I don't like where this is headed. See, I'm getting mushy. I'm already high. <laughs> You're so adorable. Do you want anything else? Um, I will never forget you! Stop me if I'm being too emo. But can you grab one of the photo albums over there? I'd like to check out some old pictures of us when we were kids. Before the end! No! My diary is like emo ground zero. Oh, don't joke about Plus, that. Plus Max Caulfield does not pass up a photo op with Chloe Price. Ever. Well, at least you're proving you remember the names. It's more than I can say. Take the photo album. Take the fucking elephant! Oh, there's a guitar starting up again. Alright. Here it is. Chew on that. What, you want me to fold the pages for you? Let me turn the... <laughs> Alright. I don't like where this is headed, guys. I really, really don't. Is that okay? Perfect. Oh my god. Look how little we are there. The paint smudges! Toys. I remember that day by the lighthouse. My dad was pissed at us. Oh, is the tornado still gonna happen? Time out. And you laughed at him. <laughs> My dad would have banished me. Sweet. Turn page. <laughs> she's gonna make me do this. Oh, I feel like oh, she's gonna fucking awesome. pass out from morphine. <laughs> Chloe! Chloe! Us in our pirate gear. We should have taken over Arcadia Bay when we had the chance. There's still time for you. Hmm. Well. Hey, look, Professor Xavier runs a whole school and he's in a wheelchair. Don't make excuses. Oh, man. There we are, making pancakes. I love that shot of us. It's hard to believe my dad took that picture only five years ago. Maybe I can use one of these photos to time travel. It really seems like yesterday. Pick it up, you idiot. Tr grab one of them. See if I it, wish it was. See if you get a, uh, Me too. a vibration or whatever. <laughs> photo. Maybe I could... Yeah, yeah, pick it up. Try it. Listen, Max. My respiratory system is failing. Oh, no! Uh, and it's only getting worse. Get the photo! Quick, she's gonna kick the bucket. I've heard the doctors talking about it when they thought I was locked out. 
That's why the so doctors should never talk in the same room as the patient, ever. Even either. if they're like, uh, that's an actual thing. My parents suffer along, and I will too. This isn't how I want things to end. What? Oh, shit. What are you saying? Assisted suicide. It's actually legal in Oregon. But being with you again has been so special. I just wanted to feel like when we were kids running around Arcadia Bay, Control. And everything was possible. Press the time button. And you made me feel that way today. Oh I shit, she's tricked me into overdosing her. To be my last memory. Do you understand? Yes, I do. All you have to do is crank up the IV to 11. Uh-uh-uh. No, 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 no. They'll fingerprint me. I'll get in trouble. I mean, it, I think it's legal in Oregon, but I'm sure there's some paperwork we have to fill out. I'm not I'm not doing this. Cuz I can just do the time thing on the photo. Ah, oh, decisions, decisions. No, do the time thing on the photo, you idiot. Chloe. I can't. It wrecks me to see you in any pain. But I don't have any right to do this. I'm an adult. I'm giving you the right. But Joyce and William. I already said my goodbyes to them. Oh. But they won't honor my wishes. You will. Oh, well, I guess I, I could can't. kill her, but then do the time thing. You with an overdose. Well, then put a pillow over my face. I'm dying from my illness, not my dosage. This accelerates. Well, you justify it however you want. I'd rather go out on a wave than a rock. And yeah, I no, I'll, I'll do it. But I mean, I think we should try my approach, which is time travel. Help you, but not like that. You have to believe me, Chloe. Well, it's okay. Give me the option. I'll do it now. You're just bailing on me, like everybody else. Why don't you go now? You've been wanting to since you got here, right? Hey, that's emotional blackmail. Come on. I know your respiratory system's failing and everything, but don't take it out on me. I am never leaving you again. Okay. Now, do the thing. Zap the photo. And go. Oh, fine. I'll fucking do the thing for you. Oh, focus on the photo. I'm sorry, William. Oh, I'm gonna kill the father again. Maybe I should just kill her. Alright. Okay, left... It's AD and left mouse button. Mouse, because last time I did this, I screwed it up, and it, the game was all, like, sort of, you know... Oh. I think after a while it just gets impatient with you and says hold down space or some shit to do it automatically. Come on, come on. Come on, Goofy, we want to see the cow in there. It's going to do it again. It's going to be like, the game's like, hold down space, we'll do it for you. Yeah, it's going to fucking... It's gonna, this is embarrassing as fuck. Come on, you stupid cow. Alright. Yeah. I wish every puzzle had a hold space. It's not like I need the help. I know what I'm doing. It's just I won't do it. Someday Dad will get one of them newfangled computers. I hope the flash didn't scare you, Max. Oh, crap. This is a keeper. Yeah, you have no idea. I should just say to him, listen, do you want to die quickly and painlessly, or do you want your daughter to suffocate for f five years? What? To get oh, to the point where she's begging people to morphine her to death. Pick you up. Oh man. Now what are you doing? There's gonna be another way. There's always a third option. People forget that about life. And no Chloe and Max wine tasting session. Dad. Don't blow it, because tonight your mother promised to make us a world famous sandwich. This is stupid. Just delay him for a couple of minutes, he'll miss that car. He might hit another one, but hey, I'll roll those dice. And so should he. Wow. This game. These people aren't thinking with their heads. Max, you are being so fucking strange. Like you're never gonna see us again. I'm not. <laughs> Chloe, I'm so sorry. I tried to make things different for you. So what happens? Does she have to live all that time again, or does she get shot back into the future? I don't know exactly. 
exactly what you're talking about, but come on. You Let's go pillow fight! Like, my whole life. You're my best friend. I've wow. got you and a great family. What's to be sorry for? We'll be best friends forever. So now how are we going to stop her from becoming an emo cow? Listen, <laughs> whatever happens, I want you to be strong. Even if you feel like I wasn't there for you. Because I will never abandon you, Chloe. We can hear a car crash out front. I'll <laughs> always have your back. Always. Wow. Oh, I should have just killed her. I know that sounds ridiculous, but it's like... Because I'm pretty sure that's something I could have reversed. I could have been like, you know... No, oh, I don't know. Maybe I should have just fucking done it. See, now I feel like I have to, after I'm done making the video, go and play the game uh, on my own and uh, try out all these different options. Which is something I thought I would do with a lot of Telltale games, but I never have. Because I just don't give it that much of a shit. Really, who really cares what happens to Bigby? Um. Wow. So I've saved the day, kind of? Gotta do what you gotta do. I wanna find out what's happened this tornado and stuff. Right. Wait, what are we carrying? A coffin? <laughs> what are we taking upstairs? Ta da. Is that us? Game's throwing me some serious curveballs. Alright. The <laughs> dad's dead. Oh, <laughs> shit. Chloe, you're back. Oh, yeah. Get the I'm fuck off me. Want to kiss me. You had your chance. Yeah. I'm just. I'm just. I'm so. Well, I can hear music. Every time this game starts playing music, I gotta fucking mute it. And that would be a cool game. I can hear ukulele. This is frustrating. I'd like to have the volume to the game back now. Space, get up. Let's get the hell away from that stereo. Wait, what? Why are we examining a board? What's going on here? Oh, we actually are solving a crime. I remember now, yeah. We got that missing chick and uh, pff, some other stuff happening. We're not doing very well, if I'm so honest. So close yet so far away. We have to do three main things. Yeah, please tell me. Right. Um, uh, what things? Each other. One, decipher Frank's logbook. Two, get Nathan's phone to find out where he's been during the Vortex Club parties with Kate and Rachel. And see whatever hidden shit he's got in his messages. Three hmm. eight-beat step douche down until he tells us about Frank, Nathan, and the dark room. And I do have a gun there. Keep it in your pants. We'll have to do this on our own. Dude, at least let me kick his ass, then rewind. <laughs> Fine, whatever. Isn't he like a lot bigger than her? She's threatening to beat up her stepfather. Well, Blackwell would be in big trouble. At least you let me take that money to pay Frank off. Don't remind me. <sighs> I just want him off your back. I can barely keep up with the plot twists. The story has more twists and turns than a roller coaster. I'm gonna cyberstalk some names and see where that leads. And to who. She's gonna look up our channel. Unless you want to hang out with him after you stood up for his ass yesterday. <sighs> Could you stop? Such a needy person, Chloe. You know what? I liked you better when you were in the wheelchair. It's way too. Quit talking to yourself, Max. No one's listening. <laughs> Except for you. <laughs> okay. It doesn't make any fucking sense. Oh no, I'm itching to go back in time and do that fucking thing with the morphine. Damn. Damn. I'm gonna. Oh. Alright, what do we got? The most expensive restaurant in town? Who's Anyone paying for that? How do they have the money? Oh, Warren? Not you again. Shut her down. Wait, what? 
Not embarrassing. Ugh, young people. Ah, I got a blurry eye. I feel better knowing you turned us both down. Ugh, what a creep. It's all good, like me. Lose my details. Lose my deets. Lose my. Alright. Ooh, haven't read the paper yet. Bacon newspaper. <laughs> Alright. NASA. Hmm. Just like Flash Gordon, that has a uh, surprise solar eclipse. Gee, this place certainly is a dump after William died. Look at him. Oh, yeah. oh, there's no sick bed in here. That's pretty cool. That's one upshot. It looks like David finished his car repairs. Maybe there's some new clues around. Yeah, he's also around, though. You want to go snooping around with that psycho's fucking monkeying around with a wrench? Get out of here, Max! I, I'm a patient man, but you're pushing me. Hey, Max. I do appreciate oh. you standing up. Oh, I made a new friend. Give me a beer. Mm, she's looking all non-spicious. <laughs> non-spicious. This is what I do when I'm snooping on David in real life. <laughs> ah! I promise I'll help Miss Grant next time. If there is one. Who's Miss Grant? Next. David really did protect Chloe. I'm glad I stuck up for him. Oh. Oh, wait, what? Oh, so he's... Okay, so we, he made shit up and said that she wasn't... Okay, cool, that's awesome. Surveillance cameras at Pan Estates? David so, must be working for the Prescotts, too. Is this guy a good guy or a bad guy or what? He's sticking up for his psycho daughter, but he's spying on everyone with cameras. Good thing you dropped the files in oil, Max. Yuck. Speak. Anything I can do for you, Max? Yeah, tell me what I, I'm doing in the game. I was just waiting for Chloe to get out of the bathroom so we can go. I owe you one. So I'll pretend what you just said is true, Missy. Excuse me. That's Miss Caulfield. Yes, sir. You and Chloe still better be careful where you wander. Because I'm watching you. There are a lot of dark places in Arcadia Bay. And I know where they're all. <laughs> I, can't, I can't even do this. I can't tell you everything that's going on at Blackwell. But it's pretty fishy. And you've seen too much already, so... I'm coming for you. Please stay out of this, Max. I'm coming too for you, little girl. I already know way too much. Big Daddy's going to put you in line. Working for Sean Prescott. What? Who told you that? Nathan Prescott. He may have oh, mentioned shit it. Ass is lucky he only got suspended. I don't think luck had anything to do with it. I could have been suspended too. Fair point. I didn't have all the evidence at the time. I, I am sorry, Max. It's what I do? So I suspend are you people. Tell me why you think I'm working for Sean Prescott? You smell like it. I saw documents that you were hired to do surveillance and security Where? in the United States. Right over there. God, damn. You are a good detective. But I didn't get hired. I gave Sean Prescott an estimate. For my own reason. Oh. Anyway. Does this shot mean somebody's snooping on us from outside the window? Week on all of us. What's going on? Especially poor Kate Marsh. Yeah, well, you know, they can scrape her off the pavement sometime soon. She's still there. Oh, Kate. You tried to help her more than anybody, Max. I sure didn't. I just like yelling at her. It was a hobby. Goddamn dorm roof wide open. I knew Kate was feeling desperate. Ooh. You even made it to the roof before me. Do you have a Polaroid of the the roof door? Can I? <laughs> so did Mr. Jefferson. <laughs> you change history, so Kate Marsh goes up there and she's just like, tick, 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 I can't get up. Stayed at home behind his back, like when Chloe calls me step douche. These artists. Oh, literally. you heard her say that? He isn't like this. Jefferson can be pretentious, but so can I. Nah, Jefferson's he's definitely he's in on this whole thing. He's a creep. That's he's, exactly what I'm talking about. He's hitting on everyone. Latest. Well, Blackwell Academy is a school for artists, so maybe this isn't the best place for you. I have a family here. Did I just try and sack our security guard? I'm just a student. Place for me, since only I know what's happening. Uh, the, pu the puppet master in this town. The new Blackwell surveillance plan to protect future students. Future students. So they don't end up like Rachel Amber. Yeah, well, putting trampolines everywhere might. Be a good start. Surveillance system. I appreciate you standing up. <laughs> when they throw themselves off the roof, they just wind up having a good time. And Chloe, to stay the hell out of this. My life is meaningless. Ah! Boom. Chloe and I. Hey, a, a trampoline. We can take care of ourselves. 
Now, excuse me, Max. I have to get, I have to get back to the camera. camera. Yeah. See, I'm an artist, too. Yeah. You should have seen what I did to some people in Iraq. Oh, yes, I was a real artist there, too. And when those insurgents wouldn't spill the secrets, so I made them spill the secrets. Yeah. Um, anyway, that's a bit of backstory there. He actually fought in Iraq, didn't, didn't you know? Do, 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 do. I'm not getting on that swing. All right, no more dead birds? Cool, somebody cleaned it up. Let's get the fuck out of here. <laughs> you have been locked out. <laughs> ah, crap. All right, so can I leave this house now? Those poor whales are like beached angels. What is going on here? Wow. Oh. Joyce really wants David and Chloe to be a family. Dinner and a movie, Chloe, blah, blah. All right. It isn't that hard to get along with people, really, is it? Oh, so I'm I'm not done yet? Yep, locked from the other side. That's cool. There's no way I can go to Chloe without going to David's locker. Oh, f f all right, okay. There was a reason I was down there. Which locker? What the hell did right. David do for Nathan? And what did his dad do for David? He uh, had a little problem with his pee pee. Sorry. But this is my official man cave, so no girl. Oh, that makes me sad. <laughs> William so stuff. Incredible to see William again. His ashes are probably in there. I wish Chloe could too. Promise me that if I ever kick the bucket, you don't just put all my things in a cardboard box with my fucking name on it, guys. Can you just promise me that right now? Anyway, <laughs> not to get all depressing. Aha! Aha! Whoa, that is a serious padlock on that locker. Hey, David, what you hiding? <laughs> I think we need to do that again. Looks like I need a key oh, or code. Damn it. I know this padlock. I was going to get to say the thing about David again. Oh, what was it? Seven something? One, two? Shit. I don't remember. <laughs> I don't remember the thing. Uh. Uh. For once, I don't have time to search for the code. I need to find a key. Oh, tits. I just played episode three, like, well, however long ago it was. Just give me the damn thing. Excuse me, Max. Do not touch one goddamn thing. <laughs> he just... On, Max. Find a way to get he just started the humming <laughs> while he was yelling at me. Shit you standing up for me. Hmm. There are. Max, I don't like people in my personal. Excuse me, Max. <laughs> Do not touch one goddamn thing. <laughs> Sorry. Come uh, on, Max. Find a way to get David out of his cave. Yeah, David, get out of the cave. All right. I'm really not sure what to do. Oh wow! Look at this. We're having a conversation again. I feel like this is how dogs see the world in their daily life. It's why they're always just like doing this, running around. It sure and... is hard to work in private with somebody watching you. Excuse me, Max. <laughs> Come on, Max. Find a way to get David out of his cave. It would be cool if I could just remember the fucking thing, you know. Can't I go back to before we talked or something? Alright. Fine. I wonder if David is going to the party. <laughs> I can guarantee that David is going to the party. David loves parties. He's always at parties. Oh, here we go. Tampa. I can't let David see me while I snag his keys. Enter the ninja. There's one Son ninja I'm going to be bitch. entering. I just fixed that fuse box. Oh, 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 oh. <whistles> wasn't... Sorry, wasn't me. Do, 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 do. Hey, dickhead. Gotcha. Wow. It weren't me. I'm just... <laughs> I just happen to be in here. Whenever... 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 <laughs> whenever anything bad happens. Yep. 
Alright, let's do it. Let's do the fucking thing. Alright. The key. I swear, I'm the key master. I swear the number started with a seven. If, you, if you're watching this part, can you just put the number that I was supposed to put as a comment? Alright. There's a pretty long odds, I know, but... Uh... Oh, maps, notes, coordinates, photos of Kate, Nathan... Oh, yes. Well, don't get too excited there, uh, <laughs> Maxie. It sounds like you're about to touch yourself. Alright. Now look, my own personal evidence. Cool. Score. Back to Chloe now. You've done your duty, sir. <laughs> okay. Shouldn't I leave the keys here? Alright. Let's get these fucking... Hey, yo, Chloe! Are you ready yet? I gave up William, but I defend David. I have to get David. back to my dorm. Are we happy? Very happy. I hit the secret file jackpot. It's Kate, Nathan, and Rachel. Plus there's some key David is like a one-man surveillance army. Now let's get the hell out of here before we get busted. <laughs> Sorry. Now let's go find out what Nathan is hiding in his room. We have to be extra careful. Probably that gun. Max, now it's time for Nathan Prescott to be afraid of us. <laughs> she walked into the door. Whoops. She backs into the trash cans. Damn it, Chloe, what are you doing out there, you stupid bitch? That was him saying that, not me. I keep telling you I don't believe in gendered insults. And I tell David too, he doesn't listen to me, he thinks I'm joking. I couldn't get in this damn door last night, I was trying so hard I couldn't... Yeah. Ah. Welcome to Happy Dreams High. <laughs> Look at this fucking bozo. He's taking his shit on the corner of the tree. Wow. And that totem? Indian totem? Where's that from? Hey! Get out of here, Max, Chloe. You, you don't oh, come here anymore. Hi, Mr. Jefferson. You're a dropout. I'm okay. Get off um, campus. And this is my friend, Chloe. Yeah. Chloe? Why isn't somebody as cool as you going to Blackwell? I was way too cool for the school. It's a long story. In actual files here. Oh. I can imagine. Max, are you sure that you're all right? Yeah, American Idol here needs to fuck off and leave me alone. Being on campus, like everything's normal. I know. Lame as it sounds, life has to go on. We've hosed up your friend, she's gonna... You know, that's a real sad thing. After, like, a serious incident, or an accident, or a murder. I mean, I'm assuming there's there's no ceremonious way to get rid of the blood, like, on the pavement. They they do just hose it, don't they? I find that to be such a terrible thought. Because your blood is, is a pretty personal thing. It's one of the most personal things that you've got. And the idea of it just being, like, washed. Like it's paint. Like, I was watching a John Lennon thing the other night, uh, you know, TV news from the day he was murdered, and it occurred to me, his blood must have been everywhere, what did they do? Did they hose that? It's like, yeah, it's history on the floor, and you, yeah, we'll just wash it into the gutter, like, yeah. Anyway, how did that come up? Nobody should have to see Have I already said that? Have I had that rant before? I feel like I have. Trying to keep up with the kids. I have some pride. Be seeing you. Jefferson's such a fucking creep. Hot floor teacher. Gross! You are out of control. Not is she yet. fucking hitting on him? Wait until the rager tonight. <sighs> Shut up. Don't be jealous because Mark Jefferson thinks I'm cool. You're gonna wind up with your head in a bloody pickle jar if you try and hit on him. I'm here, I'll see if we can get some dirt from Justin. Haven't talked to him. I feel like the conclusion of this game is gonna be getting into Jefferson's house and it's all pickled heads, just of teenage girls that used to go to his school. Let's see if I can find out where Nathan. They're like, why are so many teenage girls disappearing in Oregon? I'll tell you why, Mr. Jefferson. Have you considered eating more fiber to become more re regular, you know, to help with some of the shit problems you're having here? Hey, Daniel. You look bummed out. Are you alright? Try to shift a log. Hello, Max. I just figured out that my photos <laughs> basically suck. Oh, he's Mexican. I'm a wannabe artist. Hey, man. My photographs, they're so terrible. <laughs> Maybe you should try different subjects. Something more like your hey, Screw you, man. My that landscapes are my pride and joy. But not if I can't choose the subjects in class. If only I could draw my photographs. I think I'll just sit here bummed out, thanks. Come on, Hefe. Alright, so then I press that. And I have all the answers, because I've just interrogated them. Hey, Daniel. <sighs> Hola, Max. Hola. How you doing? You want to buy some drugs? 
Daniel, your drawings are your photographs. So draw your photos with your eyes and make the camera your lens pen. Oh yeah. Lens pen. That's what I'm just gonna I'm just gonna text yeah, David and tell him that David your photographs and your drawings. Yeah. I do feel better now. Make your eyes your you lens pen. Whatever are the fuck. Good, Max. End of the world party. Are you going to the end of the world party tonight? Oh man, I'm going home to buy tin fruit. We gotta stock up for the for the apocalypse. Lockers, not dance floors. Go to the party. That's exactly why you should go to that party. You crazy men, they're gonna beat the living shit out of me. Always for Kate. You won't be alone, Daniel. Not with you direct me up next. <laughs> no, what? No, I want nothing. I will go to the party like it is the end of the world. And then he eats a butterfly. I'll <laughs> go. Do I really want to talk to this asshole anymore? Okay. Have you talked to anybody about what happened with Kate? I don't know. Well, she broke every bone in her body, man, when she hit the deck. I did actually have a conversation with Brooke. Uh, Stop doing the accent. Very sad about Kate. So am I. It's definitely a one note joke. And angry. We should stop going to class and stage a whoa, 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 whoa. I'm trying to pass my fucking degree here. I like this revolutionary Daniel DeCosta. No, I don't. I, I, want, to, I, I want to finish my homework and get out of this shithole. He wants to hashtag and <laughs> protest his way through the whole thing. Fuck him. By the way, have you seen Nathan Prescott? Oh, I heard a rumor he's actually suspended. Yeah, but he's still gotta be on campus. That explains why he looked so pissed off when I saw him. Oh, he left campus a few minutes. Awesome, I'll have to go chase him. Let's talk later. Okay, Daniel? Good. Nathan is not around. Doop -doop 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 -doop. Look at me run. Alright. Oh, they're probably fucking fighting no, in the car park. I don't want to go there. Wait, what? What have I done wrong? Huh? Wouldn't Chloe be out there? She's not a student. Alright, fuck it. Go in here. Principal Wells was so loaded the other night here. Oh, uh, yeah, okay. Oh, here we go. Chloe. Justin, it's been so long since I've seen you. Because you're way too cool for us now, Chloe. I mean, shut the fuck up. Way too much shit going on. Beat it, dickhead. We shove him out of the way. Well, if, if it's only two stages, it's not a secret handshake. It would be so cool if you and me were going to school here together. No, it wouldn't. But now you could have Mr. Jefferson all to yourself. Ugh, you suck. Now let's get into Blackwell Ninja Mode. The window smashes and another girl's throwing herself to her death. <laughs> anyway. It's so lame, they don't have colored dorms here. Go listen to some Johnny Cash. If you could read my mind, love. He actually did a cover of that song. How funny is that? Give me the signal if Nathan or anybody shows up. I won't let you down, Batmax. Duh. Now I just have to find Nathan's room. Yeah. Let's use that, that blue light that the uh, that the cops <laughs> use. The, the light that shows up where you've come in your room, basically. Evan. Of course. That's why no shits were given. Yeah, yeah. Evan rolls. Wait, what? Well, that's basically where Nathan lives. We're a team! Everyone is doing a crime. It's not really a... Jesus! Are toilet paper wars mandatory in the dorms? <laughs> Zach or Logan? Who knows? Bro's got a bro. I can't claim to know any of these students well enough to really uh, have an opinion either way. Oh, well. This can only be Nathan's room. Kick it in. Don't, don't they lock the doors here? Wow. <laughs> what are you doing? You know, we're having a big go about him for ruling this town and being such a thug, but I've just fucking broken into his room. Wow. Now I need to find Nathan's phone. Or anything with clues. That monochrome camera is brand new and costs about six grand. <laughs> Bastard. It's a specifically monochrome camera? Do they make them now? Do they make, like, just straight up, this camera only does black and white? That's pretty funny. I thought Victoria had the photo bling, but 
Once again, the Prescott's rule. Yeah, well, not after I've jacked off onto everything in this fucking room. We'll see how, we'll see how his six thousand dollar camera shines after I've nutted on it. All right. Damn, Nathan, that's a nice shot. It's so damn creepy, but oh, Jesus, Nathan is one sick. Is that the dog that I killed, and I'm calling him a sick fuck? Open up! That is so Chloe. That's fucking... Oh my god. Chloe. Where did he get a... <gasps> Chloe. Where did he get a photo of her all zonked out? Am I going to keep that evidence? I probably should. Nathan clearly has his fetish down. Oh, she used the F word again. Oh, fuck. It's an in joke. It's an old, it's an old, it's a goodie. It's not an oldie. No, it's not a goodie, but it is an oldie. Jesus, I can barely talk. Whale songs? Maybe this is the only soothing thing Nathan ever hears. Well, it doesn't really fit his profile. Why would he be into whale songs? Maybe it's because of the, uh... There's pillboxes everywhere. This guy's medicating. Huh. I don't think one book can guide the Okay, alright. I'm here for fucking evidence. Stop fucking around. I don't think this prescription has helped, Nathan. Maybe it has. Oof, again. This, this. Aha, computer! Let's go. Nathan is way into this party. Hey, gorgeous. Let me know what That's you're wearing fine. so I can wear something just as styling and expensive. I used to say styling a lot on the channel. I think I've apologized for this before. As a joke. But I sort of stopped because it sounds like, with my accent, it sounds like Stalin. As in, you know, the, uh, the Russian. That's not really a misunderstanding you want to make more Bastard. than once. Now I remember why I hate you. And why Kate will get justice. <laughs> Kate's gone wild. That's terrible. Oh, man. Sean Prescott might be Nathan's real problem. Don't fuck it up, son. Your father. I know being a Prescott's a burden. I'll help guide, I'll guide you into this room step by step as I did my father. Well, as did my father. This shithole town is going to get an enema along with a fresh brand. Wow. Too bad Nathan isn't more like his sister. Yes, Nathan sure needs- Wow. <laughs> Kiss ass much, Principal Wells. Wow. You know, that's, that's disappointing. I had a lot of faith in the, uh, the principal. I'd cry too if I had him for a father and had to wear that suit. You do have to wear that suit. I'm gonna make you wear it right now. A gun manual! Ha ha! Holy shit. That's the gun Nathan used on Chloe. Gift from. Fine. These films all have a dark pattern. Yeah, I can see uh, two and a half men. Will and Grace. I can My rewind God. if he shows up, but. I, Nathan likes his tortured subjects way too much. Nathan took this from Kate's altar. Why? Ugh. What is with this dude? He's oh, a collector. Man. That dickhead stole one of my selfies. See, she's stolen stuff from other people so far in the game. I don't understand why she didn't just steal this stuff. Nathan Prescott. All-American teen. Fuck yeah. Well, I think it about wraps it up for this fucking room. Scratch marks. What the hell are all those marks on the floor? Is it like a marmot or something? You human paraquat! <laughs> I think we're pretty much done in here. I, I have to believe that's everything. That must be the lamp Chloe broke when Nathan drugged her. Oh, wow. That looks like a totally fun show. I get it. Even Nathan has a light side. I'm, but yeah, okay, we're pretty much, we've, we've uncovered the mystery here. We've... All right, let's get the fuck out of here. Boo! <laughs> well, time for me to get the fuck out of here. Fakovsky! No. Oh, wait. Uh, can I go? Oh. Speak. Yes, what are you doing? Hurry up! What do you mean? Max, what are you doing? Hurry up! Did I... Did I miss something? Oh, for fuck's sake, this game. It can be truly pernicious.
A book. I had to look at that yet. I don't think one book can guide. Wait, no, I did. <laughs> Jesus Christ! Come on. Whales? Yeah. Oh, deployment. That's so cute and ironic. I can't believe Nathan still has it around. Uh, it's sort of cute, actually. I think it's kind of creepy as fuck. Couch. Move the couch. Here we go. Let's find out what you're hiding. I can't believe I didn't think of that when I saw the scratch marks. There's a woman under there. My god. Evidence. Oh yes, little phone. You are mine now. Awesome. Then he shows up. Now I have Nathan's phone, so I can show it to Chloe. Well, before Nathan comes back. Alright, hurry the fuck up. Let's go. Look at the phone. Damn, Max, you're finally back. I got worried. Yeah. So, what did you find? His room was clean and... Clean. Wasn't that clean? Jesus. Check this out. So fucking don't just play with it in the corridor. Oh, Nathan, we got you by the balls, fucker. Hey, what are you guys doing with my phone? What are you doing in my door? <laughs> Called it again. I'm too good. You're such a nosy bitch, Max. Whoa. Stop right there, Nathan. Make me ho. It's getting physical. Max, don't, those are scratches on his face. Get the fuck out of my face. <laughs> Why was that louder than the rest of the dialogue? <laughs> You are so fucking dead! Yeah. Get off me, bro! Oh. <laughs> awesome. Great. Stay out of it. Hey, we found the gun! You like to hurt people, huh? You like to hurt like people, Max? huh? Like Kate? Like me? Huh? Feel this, motherfucker! That's <laughs> <laughs> great. Use the fire extinguisher. Whoa! Please! Oh, he's, he's had enough. <laughs> Please stop! My beautiful face! Alright. He's down! Hey, come on! Well, now we're all in trouble. Stop! Sorry. Yes, we have to go! Yeah, let's put a few bullets in him! Who's the bitch now? Chloe! <laughs> We should probably hand the gun into somebody. Damn, Warren went full alpha on Nathan. And it was good. But scary. There's nothing good about it. You know, I'm joking Shit, around here. But it like, hurts. the last time I saw somebody get beat up in person in real life, I like, I, I felt ill. I thought it was terrible. Fake violence is extremely funny, but um, no one gets off on real violence. And if you do, you might be a bit tapped. Damn, that was intense. Warren, uh, thank you so much. No, 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 no. For what? For beating the shit out of Nathan Prescott? Don't think that this gets you any, like, points. Any pussy points. Any any tickets on the P train. Uh, we're not going out. Ever. Good to know. If I can be celibate for this entire game, I will be. I better stick with you guys. Just in case you need me to get my Hulk on again. Or should I call the cops? Yeah, have we handed in the gun no yet? police. Not yet. Uh... So maybe you better fuck off. Um, Warren, me and Max have to do this on our own. No offense. Oh, I must go That's alone. Cool. Luke. Whatever I can do. That is help. not your destiny. What you can do is find out anything you can about Nathan's father. I must face Vader alone. Between the snow and eclipse, I'm assuming the apocalypse is around the corner. And thank you. Why does he suddenly sound different? Did his balls drop just because of that beatdown? I should go punch a motherfucker out. Maybe I'll become a man after all these years. Anyway. Right. Man, that guy is so fucking in love with you. Yeah, well, he's not getting any. I know. He really did give a serious beat down to Nathan. It was a little scary to watch him do that. Now let's make a date with Frank. Wait, what? Will he even answer you? Frank always answers when he wants money. So whose phone is that? Is that Nathan's phone? Like I said, Frank wants to see me right now. Let's not keep him waiting. Do -ba -do -ba -do. I have to add my own soundtrack to this game. Do -ba -do -ba -do. You heard me complaining about all the copyrighted hipster music, so now it's like, you know... It's giving me the silent treatment! No, you, no ukulele for you, Scotty. Right, what happened here? 
that was a really awkward arm folding. Like it felt quite. Hang on. Hm. Uh, that just hurt my armpits and my tits. Uh. This is how we do. Do 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 do. This is how we do. God, they hate seeing those poor whales like that. <sighs> so stop going to the beach. <laughs> you got a problem? Their families in the ocean out there looking for them. I don't think that's how whales think. Gonna help us Probably is actually. Wales are pretty intelligent. Oh, what? You'll actually shoot him? Chloe, do not count on my rewind. Seriously. Obviously, I'm not counting on you. That's why I have a gun. And I might even save you someday. Do we have that other gun? It looked better. I am so going to hit you. With a gun. There's no way we could have guessed this is what would happen to us when we grew up. It could be worse, I mean, it could be in a wheelchair. Or did the day when we can just go on a road trip to Portland. Fuck yeah. You, me, and Rachel. She's bones. Absolutely. For God's sakes, forget about her. She's a corpse. Let's play this cool, okay? Just pay Frank his money, and then we can get that code for the book from him. The code. That's all. Yeah, that sounds, like a, that sounds like a good plan. Well That's done, Max. Whatever. Does the gun have bullets this time? Those might help. She's got it going on, i got to say. I like her fashion sense. Good old Chloe. Blue hair's a bit of a try-hard thing. It's a bit, uh... Scott Pilgrim. Everybody knows that the Chinese chick was way nicer to him than the uh, girl with the blue hair. But, um, purple hair, whatever it was. I haven't seen that film in a while. Fucking Scott Pilgrim. Fuck me. You should've got with the Chinese chick. You in there, Mr. White? Alright. Open up. Motherfucker. You killed my dog! Knock on the fucking door. <sighs> gonna make me wait. Oh, right. look. The Wonder Twins. We don't even look the same. You should have come alone. She's <laughs> my partner. <laughs> my partner? <laughs> yeah. Yeah, we're bodyguard. So let's get to business. Where's my fucking money? It's everywhere! <laughs> we threw it away, we opened the bag up and just went, bye bye money! Give him the, yeah, give, give him the cash. I like your skeleton top, it's kinda scary. It's like, a big, like a big skeleton staring at me. Hey. Oh, I thank you. That wasn't so This hard is Monopoly long. money, you think you could trick me so easy? Business again. Now if you excuse me. I'm gonna go jack after my, my new cash. Could we ask you a couple quick questions? About what? You have some serious lady balls. I do not. No. No. It's gonna get serious. We're gonna pull a gun Jesus. on him. Okay. Okay. Wait, what? But I'm not getting you high. It's changed his mind. Frank, we're not here to get high. Come on in. I'm just no. so I'm so sad after the death of my dog. Not like Chloe here. So what do you Hardy boys want? Just the names of. At least we're not lady boys. <laughs> Well, why didn't you just tell me? How about I just give you the keys to my RV while I'm at it? I already stole them. How'd you get them back, by the way? <laughs> you already did. Ah, oh, you fucking mental. I lost my keys, but I changed the lock. Oh. You better goddamn not be snooping. Oh, that's a lot simpler than going on the roof and trying to find them. No, I'm not. I... I... Oh, Christ, I hate you, Blackwell shits. You expect everything for free. Why is You're so not pissed? getting any handouts from me. I work for a living, you understand? Yes, Frank. Without those Blackwell shits as customers, you wouldn't have any work at all. Dude, you're a drug dealer. Yeah, right, okay. Both of you are giving me a headache. No deal. Frank, we didn't come here to fight. This is so much bigger than us. We just gave you money. You you come in peace? After you aimed a fucking gun at me, and then pulled the trigger. It wasn't loaded. I was just fucking with you. There were no bullets in the gun. We were safe, tough guy. There is something wrong with you, girly. You pulled the trigger because you wanted to show me how safe I was? I just... I didn't know what I was doing. We all do things we regret. Get off her ass. She was protecting me. You've got a knife and God knows what else. Are you really afraid of Max here? I'm not afraid of anybody except my maker. And you little bitches think you can outsmart me? Why, because I'm trailer trash? No, You're Blackwell really... trash. And it's time to take you out. Uh -oh. Calm down, Frank. Let's just Don't talk. Don't you ever tell me what to do. Get it, bitch! Get it! Step the fuck back now! Oh my god! <laughs> he got him! Gosh! You actually shot me! I wasn't gonna hurt you! 
Oh, this fucking hurts! Oh. Wow, this guy's got some seriously inconsistent morals. You shot him, I know. You're both fucking crazy! What do you want? We... We just want the code for your account book. Now. Oh, the code for the oh, account whatever. book, of course. Put the goddamn gun down. <laughs> Accounts. It's my favorite. There. Now leave me alone, all right? Just, just get out of my life. Do you want us to call an ambulance or? Yeah, he could actually bleed to death, you know. No, thanks. You know what? I'll manage somehow without the police. I just wish oh. my dog was still alive. Let's bounce. <laughs> we just shot a guy. Wow. I guess he's not so tough after all. I thought he'd be like the menacing opponent of the game. Because it's got to be Jefferson. Jefferson's out of this whole bum deal. You know why? Because he stopped appearing in the game all of a sudden. Way worse, but Frank might be more dangerous to Chloe now. Yes, Max, you can change all this if you want. If he's got a gas tank anywhere in or around the Winnebago, we could set fire to that and just kill him right now. Just thought. Thought balloon. Just putting it out there. Me and my time jumping. Oh wait, I didn't do it then, did I? <laughs> Damn. These are just scribbles. Chloe, are you okay? Yeah, what? I'm fine. I always shoot people. That's what I do. I just, I'm sorry. I, I just keep thinking about I shooting. Love guns. Like. Guns are so cool. Please don't. You saved us, Frank. The only thing that stops a bad guy with a gun is a good guy with a gun. Um, so do we win? Better focus on this board and start tying these clues together. It's a somewhat incomplete board, uh, Max. I hate to tell you this. Maybe you should leave this to the real police. Huh? Anyway, investigate. Oh. <laughs> investigate. Gather info on a character by selecting all the collect crew. <laughs> For each section. Oh no, what are we gonna do? Let's look at Frank's drug deals during the week of the party. Alright, do we have to? Wait, what, what, hang on. Oh, crap! This is something I actually have to do. Oh. Okay, look. Frank's account book. But the client names are encrypted. Oh no, encrypted accounts! <laughs> I'm sorry. Frank is for sure the local dealer, but... I, I doubt Rachel was carrying drugs for him. I should probably, well, she'd do anything for right? him. Maybe Rachel took a road trip with Frank, but she did come back. My guess is she was up in this up to her elbows. So, what happened to Rachel after this? She dumped Frank, but I don't think he would hurt her. I'm a Leo and we don't look back. Oh boy. Great astrology. That's just, you know, perfect. Rot must stand for Rottweiler. That does fit Nathan. Rotten. Oh yeah, we beat the shit out of Nathan, I just remember. <laughs> Fuck, that's not good. There's no doubt she loved him in some way. Yeah. Hang on, what? Look at it again. Yeah. Fuck, I'd it forever. There's that big F word again. Listen, as soon as you hear that, fucking turn tail and run. So weird how close they were. But Frank couldn't keep Rachel. Wait, so what am I doing? Or protect her. Select. Uh, nope. Maybe I should try to link other clues oh, together. Oh, hang on a minute. Wow. This might be one of those things where I need to, like, to watch a walkthrough. <laughs> Crap. David's case. Oh, yeah. Thanks to David's own investigation, I should be able to find out what Nathan did during the party's week. Yeah. Or I could just sit here scratching my head like a moron. Of course, I'm a suspect. <laughs> Proving David sucks as a detective. Sorry. That's okay. David really has been on Rachel's ass for a while. That's where I wish I was. She should have been upset. Alright. Yeah, look, I'm just scrabbling around here. I don't really know what I'm doing, so I'm just gonna quickly get a hint from somebody else's walkthrough. <laughs> that could be code for them solving the thing for me. I don't know. We'll just see what I have to do. One minute. Oh, oh shit. <laughs> the record button has control, alright? It's control zero. So she just time jumped for no reason. Um, 
It's a bit. It's a bit embarrassing. I kind of. I know what I have to do, but I just don't want like half an hour of me figuring it all out. So I just watched somebody's walkthrough, and my internet's so patchy at the moment that I had to like you know go on my 4G and fucking watch somebody's YouTube videos. So you know, I mean, it's. I mean, it's kind of kind of crappy having to hop between the computer and then when the internet on the computer goes down, you know, get the phone. But you know, we won't be needing that anymore because I watched the fucking watched the video. So um, anyway, let's have a have a little look see at this little board here. Board, um, okay, I think it's, I wrote down all the little things that I have to put together, because I just thought, you know, watching me figure this shit out is going to be yes, boring as batshit. The, the game is on, yeah, you yeah. bet it is. Talk to us, account book. Yes. Tell us everything. Know these pieces together. Do you mind? Roger that. I, I have to, study the board and I have to be fucking quiet, because it's, it's just gone 1am, and you know. Everyone in the household is trying to sleep now. My hair has gotten so... I don't know what happened. I didn't use any different product and my hair's just exploding. Anyway, sorry. I worry about the big things in life. Alright. I mean, this is, so, this is so cheating, you know, but... You know, Einstein... You don't sit through all of Einstein's workings when you look at... When you think about E equals MC squared. You just get the end result. You know. So, um, that's basically my justification here. Alright. <whistles> anyway, I listened to some lovely David Gilmore. You probably can't hear it, it's very quiet. I've been listening to that while I made my uh, final drink for the evening. Ooh, very nice. Alright. I hope I transcribed all this properly. Uh. And that's all she wrote. Yep. Please let me find some Keep in mind, I could solve these puzzles if I wanted to, right? Because um, I was watching the video of the other person doing it, and it's as simple as this. I could do a lot of things like uh, when I was in sound engineering, you know, you have to do a lot of sound flow diagrams and stuff like that. It's all logic, I can do it, Great. it's just I'd now, how do I really rather not waste my time. So. Da, 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 da. <laughs> oh yes, now we're That's finally great. getting somewhere. These really are very trivial puzzles. Though. Chloe, let's plug in these numbers and see if they lead to an actual address. Unfortunately, I have to wait for all this stuff to happen. Here we come, Rachel. More David Gilmore. This is his latest album. I mean, I don't think it's good as On an Island, but I mean, it's pretty. It's pretty fair. I haven't put out many albums lately, so I'm not going to criticize him. Uh, now what do I do? Uh, boom, boom, I boom, have to analyze boom, Nathan's boom, messages. Yeah. What could help me unlock this? Hopefully, thing? we'll get back to some fucking adventuring soon. Ta -da. Okay, Max. Let's blow this code up and go home. Yeah, I agree. Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa! Somebody just text me. Get ready to fucking die, bitches. You fuck <laughs> get ready to fucking die, bitches. Is he deliberately texting with a speech impediment because we fucked his mouth up or what? And he wasn't so tough when he was crying on the floor either. Let's start hacking. Alright, fuck this. Can I type the number in or do I have to fucking do this? Ah, jeez. Alright. I hope this works. Oops. Back oh. oh, was it? What did I do wrong? I might have to pause again. I'm just putting it around in numbers. Yeah, I knew it wouldn't be that easy. Jeez. You locked it, dumbass. Oh, so then I have to what? Do the big number. Okay, right. Guys, you know, this isn't this isn't my idea of fun. <laughs> you can skip ahead if you want. <laughs> I want the plot to pick up again. I'm actually just dying to go back and see if I can actually euthanize my friend, like if that's a- or if it'll like, like, she'll do the thing with the morphine, and then she'll go, no I can't do this, and after her friend's dead she'll do the photo thing and um... Oh yeah, let's find out what Nathan I feel like that's how it would go. Hide. Huh. Bring it to me. Yes. Uh, this is all about Nathan trying to score for the Vortex Club party. She's phone sexing herself. Yes! Uh. Nathan was jonesing hard the night of the party. 
He did drug dealer drama. God, Nathan. So it was you. Oh, that's the text I got. Now I can officially call you. No, Nathan. It's time for you to watch out. Wow. Asshole. These teens are all getting so fucking serious with each other. Is this from Nathan's father? Alright, that's cool. That's brutal. Yeah, alright. Awesome. Nailed it. One more board to go? I hope so. I hope it's only one. Jeez, I can't do any more of this. Even with all of the things laid out in front of me, it's still long and tedious. Take a breath, Max. All Go right. through all this data and you can find out where Nathan took yeah. Kate after the party. Yeah, yeah, sure. Another time. I'd love to play this again one day with just... fucking around. I mean, figuring it all out for myself Please. and stuff. This is definitely... And enjoying it and soaking up the experience and not taking the piss out of everything. I probably will. If I can justify spending the time on it, but, um, yeah. Nope. Nothing, Max. There's nothing here. It's a shitty old barn. Oh, cool. Let's keep searching and find out who owns this haunted barn. <laughs> I'm on this. Why is it haunted? See, I've been jumping the gun and assuming Rachel's dead with the whole game. Now Max is doing it. Aaron Prescott. You want to press Scott? You can, you can do that anytime. Should we call the police? Police! Fuck that. You know the police here are like Nathan's private security, right? That's so messed up. That's daunting. As you've noticed, this whole town is messed up. We can't trust anybody. Except each other. Except each other. So we have to go out to that farmhouse by ourselves. Good idea. I was afraid you'd say that. We could call no, Lawrence no, 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 no. kicks Nathan's ass. It's just the two of us. I doubt he has the energy for more than one beating per week. That guy can't lift. We're this close to finding Rachel. We have to find her, Max. We will. But remember, my power isn't infinite. We still have to be careful. I think you're being a little paranoid, Max. You're I mean, here, Chloe. You used a photo to fucking save your friend from a spinal injury. That's pretty potent stuff. So can she do that to any Polaroid or just magical ones taken with a magic camera? Here's the haunted barn. Again, I don't know why it's haunted. It's not like there's ghosts there or anything. Holy shit, this is scary. There's gonna be a talking spider in there and a pig that knows how to write. Let's go find the best way in. Chin up, chin up. Dip -a -dip -a -dip -a -dip -a -dip chin up. Ever, ever, ever see Charlotte's Web? Charlotte's Web? Charlotte's Web. It's a good. Whoa, check this out. Fresh tire tracks. Dude, somebody was just here. Wow. They were cleaning up the evidence because they knew we were onto them. Before. Maybe Rachel's in there. Tied up. And we're going to rescue her. Mm. You know, be, to be quite honest, I don't like Chloe's figure. Not that that's like the whole point of the game or anything, but just, you know. Just, I'm being conversational. Hmm. These are thick tracks and definitely fresh. She was Nathan's shitting on... TV? She was shitting on his car, right? Nathan, the rich guy's car. But it looked very similar to the one that her dad, her non-dead dad, bought her to have her car crash in. It's like, oh, double standards much. Are you going to judge the car or what? Oh. Chloe. Oh, that's not what I want. It said Warren. Why can't it just take me straight to the one that I just got? Hey, what do you want? Get the fuck out of my life. Alright. The squirrel holds the key to the entire adventure. Oh. Watson, we can safely assume that this ancient vehicle is not our suspect. Alright, calm down. Oh, that's our car. Okay. Alright. Case closed. Ugh. So what are you doing? You gonna jimmy the damn thing or what? Chloe is so damn fearless. Where does that come from? I wasn't so fearless when she was in the wheelchair, that's all I'm saying. Not so formidable. <laughs> formidable. There's got to be a set of keys around here somewhere. Look, a submarine! If we can get this thing working again, maybe sail out to sea, say some of those whales. Metal sheet. Move it. Wow. Every secret layer should have a back door that goes in as well as out. It's common sense. Why even have a lock on the door? Boy, I found the front door. Come on. You found the back door. Max. Oh, yes! Maximus rules. Don't call me that. We're not Romans. God, this is 
way too Blair Witch. I have goosebumps all over. That's your allergies. Come on, Supermax. I have them too. I'm coming in in hives. Right. Hey, that check out this old chest. It's not an old chest. It's still got some fucking oomph in it. A little louder, Chloe. All right. Jeez, that is ancient. It's an Egyptian line. Man. Old shit. No, look closer. Harry, Aaron, Prescott, and family donate your library. Oh, Arcadia Bay. Bay. I'm still Prescott. not a fan of the whole Arcadia name. Couldn't they pick the better one? Prescott's green bomb shelter boomed to town. My scrapbook. It sounds like arcade, and that just sounds like you're trying to be cool. Area. I don't know why it bothers me, but it does. Make hay while the sun shines. Let's eat the hay. <laughs> it's like, look yes, at that big piles of wheat bigs. Clippings. But that can't be the only thing here. Well, let's fire up the old tractor. Let's get this thing going again and save the whales. This tractor has paid its dues. What does that mean? If you ask me, I've paid my dues, but nobody else, nobody else seems to think so. Eleven hours in the tin pan. God, there's got to be a better way. Well, who are you? If a zombie shows up, I have my weapon. Oh, that's all we need, zombies. I would be I would have been so disappointed if this had been a zombie game. <sighs> These hooks are used to lift haystacks. I saw them in a Friday the thirteenth movie. Ah, oh, the good old days. Eggs, bacon, sugar, coffee, cocaine, what not? Co Alright, don't mind them. Are we done? So many haystacks. So, so many haystacks. Uh, get, I get the so point. So few needles. What the fuck? Alright. Did it? We searched the whole barn. This whole game seems to boil down to me just searching rooms until I eventually... The last thing I click on is the thing that I need. Even Harry Aaron Prescott was into selfies. That's not a selfie. If it was a selfie, his arm would have been outstretched holding the camera. Like... Like I've always tried to take my selfies so that you can't really see that I'm doing them, but you can because I'm, 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 my arm's like, you know, quite obviously. But I don't like that look of having the arm in the fucking camera. So. I think I'm a pretty accomplished selfie taker, to be honest. And they're really not a very me thing to do, yet uh, I do them, so. Chloe would make a great detective, too. Yeah, a real pro. A real fucking Columbo. Look at that. Are we done? Oh. It's always the last place you look. I guess the press cuts were just born bastards. Outstanding debts. 1903. Fuck me. Safe. Shot Prescott. Safe to assume it has nothing to do with our case. Alright, so are we done? What about these boxes? Jesus. You can't just rule these things out, Chloe. Oh, ground. Of course, the trapdoor. That's where the big green thing that Superman finds is hiding. Nothing here. Oh. Except for the trapdoor? Oh. Just go about the perimeter, Max. There has to be more here than this crate. Fuck your perimeter. Just rotting wood. See, what if I'd picked... Like, if that was the thing that I have to be searching for, what if I picked that first? I swear these weren't here before. I think the game is fucking making me overexert myself. You know what it is? It knows I used a walkthrough before. It can tell. It's like, nobody's that good. Whoa. What is this? The DeLorean. But it's been here since the 1800s. Why? No lights. Supermax. You can't open this with your oh, bare get hands. Get the pitchfork, you clever little hipster. Let's fucking get that thing open. Okay, Chloe. Um, I, I found some kind of hat. Let me know the second. Pretty sure you know. this old pitchfork won't open a padlock. Try again, Max. It's really quite galling to interrupt somebody's real voice with your internal imaginary voice. What is this thing? There's no way this rusty ass button will activate these ropes or pulleys. Oh. Alright. Wow, sir. Talk about home on the range. Yeah, that's, that's, that's a good one. Nice work, Max. <laughs> so okay, there's no reason for anybody to drive out of here. But there must be. There must be some reason. This should be a strong bad game, I'm telling you. No, there's nothing the in this crate. Just there's bastards. nothing left in the crate for me to investigate. I gotta go over here, though. The cheat shows up. Hey, the cheat, come help me open up the padlock. 
Oh, God. <laughs> yeah. World's worst strong band impression. You know, I did a good one in a video once. I think it was Jedi Knight. It's pretty much the zenith of my uh, strong batting. Pretty sure this old pitch All right, okay, will I got open a good idea. Lock. Try again. Dash. Oh, what are we doing? Oh, all right. Cool. So, so, so now what? Follow the rope and then. She said the thing wouldn't work. There's no way this rusty ass button will activate these ropes or pulleys. So now what do I do? Can I climb up there? Platform. Gotta get up there. Climb. Climb. Here we go. Chloe, can you give me a hand? This is the only time you're ever allowed to put your hands on me, you fucking crazy. Sidekick at your service. Yeah. Ta-da. Nailed it. Huff, huff and away, Supermax. I spit Thank on you. you. I nice. spit on you and your fucking banter. <laughs> Oh, wow. Oh, she meant to do that, okay. Right. So that was kind of risky, pulling down a heavy piece of machine around here. You can't time shift if you fucking had your head caved in by... by heavy things. <laughs> Alright. Pull! Nope. I can't pull this rope without tearing my flesh off. Oh, fuck me. I need to hook this up to something heavier. How about Chloe? <laughs> hey, I heard that! I feel like this is going in a fucking... Uh, whoa! Is that an owl? This is going in an arachnophobia direction. All of a sudden there's going to be a giant South American tarantula just fucking chilling. Alright. All right, I've done a pretty good job here. Let's, uh, I've nailed it again. How do I... So what do I fucking do? Just hang myself? Is that what you want? I'm not what? Robin Williams? <laughs> oh, shit. You know... I'm not making fun of him. I really feel like a lot of people missed the point. Well, not not, not the point. I'm not saying there's a point to suicide, but um, they were all like, "Oh, he was depressed." Like the guy, it probably went beyond him being in like a bad mood. He was suffering a form of dementia. I mean, the guy was probably hallucinating all the time. It was probably really fucking him up. Probably just wanted to get away from all that shit. Not that depression wasn't a factor, but yeah, it's like a, it's not just an open and shut sort of. Thing in his case. Um, anyway. Max, use your rewind and get that motor back up. Oh. <laughs> yeah, thanks, game. I, uh, I really dropped the ball here. I was walking around talking to myself, not really paying attention. Sorry. Sorry about that. It is almost 1.30 a.m., so I, you know, definitely won't be doing any more Life is Strange tonight. Um... <laughs> I'm gonna try and squeeze in episode five in the in the wee hours. No, I think I'll try and play that tomorrow. Ah, oh, I'll do it tomorrow. There's gonna be people over. Help me plan my week, guys. Max Skyver strikes again. Okay, you. That was that was definitely a bit of a stretch. Um, you know all about them getting stretched, huh? No. <laughs> Sorry. These are these are terrible jokes. Every time the game throws a terrible joke at me, I have to throw one back. It's the way the universe works. It's equilibrium and all that. Oh. There we go. That's where Rachel's gonna be. I hope. Well, I mean, I hope she's not in there for her own sake, but... Ta-da! A lair! With working what lights? Is this? Air Force jackpot. 1! Not jackpot. We're in trouble. If the press gods find out what... Do I even need to say how weird this is? What are the press gods up to? He is dead. I'm asking the big questions. Who built this kind of place? A press god, of course. There's a stargate down there. Well, I'm not following her down there. She can fucking uncover the mysteries herself. I'm I'm bailing. No, sorry. Down we go. Oh. Pfft. Right. Nice. You have to this guess the code. The is so surreal. How are we going to know the code? I don't know the code. I haven't got a clue. I don't want to have to call up another walkthrough. Hang on. These games, they make it so hard to zoom in on the character's face. Some games, they're really good at it. Look at her. Look at her. Wow. Um. Oops. Bad 
code. Hey, if we get the bad, if we get the code wrong a few times, does that mean the Prescott's come to find us? Pink, pink. <laughs> I love the little noise it makes. One more time. Oh. You locked it, dumbass. Oh shit. All right. I don't remember. I mean, what, is it in my evidence file? Can I do this without having to call up a fucking walkthrough? Oh look, I'm one of the photos on the screen. Look, look, I'm a Polaroid. Hang on, I, I don't fit in with any of these people. I'm not cool enough. And my hair's a disaster tonight. Look at this, it's getting bigger. I'm just not cool enough for any of these people. Uh, I'm gonna pause, one sec. Oh man, the time thing... Why does there have to be control? Can I remap that? That's really annoying. Anyway. It does the time thing whenever I fucking start recording again. Some numbers look funny, oh, shit. so... I just have to get lucky. I just have to look at Firefox for a second. <laughs> Okay, hang on. Ah, oh, let's do this. Things like this should be random in every game, so that you have to like actually figure it out every time. That would be cool, because then you go up and look up, look up a walkthrough, and you're like, oh, okay, it's five four two, whatever, and then you come into the game and it's like, it's wrong. Nope, you have to go through all the clues yourself and figure it out, dickhead. That would be cool. Even though it would interfere with my life, I, I, I would approve of that system. Just saying, game developers. Alright. That's a hell of a coffee thermos. Now what the hell is this? Alright. Start paying attention, Scotty. I don't want to rely on walkthroughs for everything. I want to solve some mysteries. Whoa. This says it all about Psychiatrist. Me. He needs help. Wow. Cannot treat him, disconnected reality, yada yada. Okay, he's, he's serious. Up. Well, I kind of pegged that he already needed help when he tried to kill my friend in the bathroom in the first five minutes of the game. I may have been paying attention to that. Look at these cans. David must shop at the same store. David's buying mushrooms? Jesus. David, for God's sake, talk to me. You know, you need help, you need food, I'll go shopping with you. We'll buy something else. Mushrooms? Eh, not so much. More survivalist supplies. My favorite cereal. Water supplies. It's like in David's garage bunker. Yeah. Anyway, whoa! Wow. Oh, let's get that. Let's get that. Duct tape in a bunker is always a bad sign. What are you talking about? Duct tape is handy shit. Just because it's in a bunker. I mean. Whoa! Photography studio. That's an original signed illustration. Of somebody it's eating an octopus. Together. Yeah, it's real, real clever. Wow. Somebody was just here, too. This whole place is like rigged up. Somebody likes their whiskey. Well, smoke it if you got it. I mean... <laughs> yeah. These newspapers are all about Rachel and Kate. Wow. Wow, scary stuff. What's with the Prescott's and creepy art? Oh, shit! It's the guy's jacket! I'm surprised it's not a trail of blood after we kicked the shit out of him, though. Oh, shit. That's Nathan's jacket. Has he been here recently? Is it still warm? That's a good question. Everything is sketchy as fuck. Nothing about Rachel here. Yeah. Apples and roundabouts. Holy shit, it's the thing from the thing. The files are the names. Oh, crap. Oh, shit. Just blew the case wide open. Wait, does that mean you've I mean, solved it, or you've just uncovered more? About. We are. Oh, crap. Oh. Okay. A binder marked Victoria, but it's empty. Yeah, Look, like she is. one says Kate. Oh, no, Kate. No. God, I should have killed that bastard back there. Wait, so she's kidnapped? Kate wasn't the first. All those binders are filled with other victims. I'm a, not kidnapped, you know what I mean? She was tied Victoria up for photos. Nathan must be planning to dose her tonight at the Vortex Club party. Yeah, but I bet Mr. Jefferson's in on it. This can't be real. These are all... These are all post shots, right? What the fuck happened? Right? Show me the photos Tell again. Me. Look at her face. She's... out of it. Maybe... Maybe Nathan paid her a shitload of cash to do this. She probably would have. I don't think so. Why is he putting her on the ground like that? Where? The junkyard. Max, we have to find that spot now. Then, then we can see what he did. There's no way she's dead. No way. She posed for those pictures. Well, I know look, I don't want to disappoint you, Chloe, but I've been saying she's been dead since the start. 
I mean, I'm an optimist. Let's hope she's alive, but... Fuck. Oh my god. Rachel. Kate. Hey, is there one with my name in it? Files. This place actually feels evil. Shouldn't we be nabbing all the evidence while we're here? Hack into the, the computer. In oh, here. crap! Oh my god. No. That's so wrong. This whole, this whole game is fucked, man. Alright, let me look at the note. What is going on with Nathan, Nathan I've told you to never call me using your phone. Stick with the disposable ones I gave you. I don't want you to hear you screaming at my name in public place, which you have stupidly done before. I haven't set all this up and then shared my vast wisdom just so you can fuck it up with your teen rage. We can accomplish a lot together, but you have to let me guide you, or you're on your own. Signed, Don Draper. <laughs> Alright. Alright. Rachel's file. That's fucked, man. Oh yeah, school suspension is a deal breaker in the Prescott family. This game's messed up. This is my final warning. Oh, oh papers, please. Papers. That son of a bitch. Stormbreaker bunker. Yeah. Stormbreaker. So when the storm comes, he'll be in here chilling with the fucking murder souvenirs. Talk about tortured. Yeah, I can do that too. I'm not a visionary. I'm just a guy. This is a very good game. Don't, don't get me wrong. Photo printer. Oh my god! That's going to be A1 or something. An A1 printer? Let's wheel this shit out of here. Forget the rest of it. I guess Nathan needs the most expensive printer in the You have no idea how much that would rock to have one. Anyway. Do -do 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 -do. But, yeah, leave the dark room. Fuck this place. Jesus. This game's getting twisted. Oh. It's, it's playing music. This is what I hate. The drama is intensifying, and now I have to turn down the sound because of copyright. And I bet all these assholes that are on pissant YouTube networks don't have to worry about this kind of stuff. Do you know how many emails I get from Indians telling me about their fast-growing YouTube <laughs> networks? It's so great. Well, I'm glad you do, because I was here looking for bottles for like half an hour before. And it got me nowhere. Well, I gave you some bottles to shoot at. That's about it. Wait, is she in the ground then? You can't dig with your hands, don't be ridiculous. Well, I hope she's not in there. This is terrible. Oh, no, 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 no. That's not a dead body, is it? Oh, no! Oh, crap! Oh, no! She's actually dead! See, I've just been guessing. Although, to be fair, we just found out who did it. We went to the bunker and now we have all the evidence. It's pretty much open shut. But it doesn't look too good for the Prescotts, just saying. So they're all going to the slammer. All we have to worry about is the tornado. Fuck. That's terrible. And the fridge falls down. Crap. Oh man, this game got but all of a sudden became a real huge bummer. Again, it does that at least once every episode. What's that? Is it a ghost? Oh, it's a deer, right. Okay. Fuck. Was she in the ground when we were here the other day doing target shooting? Awkward. And why my junkyard of all places? I still say Mr. Jefferson's in on the whole damn thing. Hear the music? So now what the hell do we do? I can't think of a good course of action here other than, you know, I hope Nathan enjoys his last call the cops. Chloe. 
We can go right to the cops. We have proof. Well, by the time we tell the police, the bunker's gonna get torched. I wanted us to find her. So we could get real justice. And revenge. The Prescotts have had this coming for a hundred years, and nobody is gonna get in my way. I don't Isn't know. <laughs> you can count me out of this. You're gonna get us both killed with your cockamamie schemes, Chloe. You know that. Wow. What do, what do we do? We're not even invited to this party. You weren't even invited. Have you ever had that said to you? Oh, crap. She's gonna mark Chapman up in this bitch. Fingers in the trigger. Trigger warning. No, like, actual trigger. Right. Who are these dipshits? I can't tell if uh, poor sweet Taylor. Can't be too Jesus, Chloe, look up at the sky. Possible. Beautiful. I don't give a shit. The world is ending. Cool. <laughs> You're not listening. Something major is going down. That's right. Yeah, Taylor on my pole. Right. Yeah, why is there two moons? What the fuck? That's never happened Welcome before. Come to the end of the world, ladies. Oh, I'm fuck off, Warren. I'm not in the mood for your crap. You look really good, Warren. Are you alright? You're gonna make me punch you out? I really feel dumb, Nathan. I just hate bullies. And Max, he's dangerous. You don't know the fucking half of it. We were just in the murder room. I didn't see him at the dorm again. And I was held up in my room. Dude. Drink a drink and fuck off. Mm -hmm. Well, if you consider half a beer drinking. Let's go, Max. Hey, hey. I know this is a bad time, but can I get one picture? And I've been feeling like this might be actually the end of the world, so... Well, hurry the fuck up and do it. I wanna it. have something for prosperity. Well, I don't blame you, Warren. Get it I over know, with. I know, I know. I'm paying the booty. Just one picture. You are stretching this out. Uh, action. <laughs> We've got no time for this shit. Come on, Max. Yeah, please. God's sakes. I just wanted to feel like a normal student after this week's ultra violence. Well, that's a good name for an album. Never hit Can we get on with this shit already? I was always the one getting my ass kicked. Oh hey, my god. There needs to be a punch Warren button. If you see Nathan, text me immediately, okay? And do not let him see you. Die. <laughs> I'm, I'm exaggerating a bit. He has been a bit of annoy an annoying character, though. Text soon. Text this. Go jack off. It'll make you feel better. Alright. Now, finally. The showdown. Or is this where the episode ends? I have Oh. What's this song sound like? It's something like any beat I've ever heard before. Usually I sing famous songs along with, uh... Songs that I haven't identified yet. Curtain. It's curtains for you, bimbo. Let's go. Hey, Max. Welcome to the end of the world. Do you want me to check anything in? Yeah. Yeah. Check in my little friend here. No, thanks, Stella. Have you seen Nathan yet? No, thank God. That boy creeps me out. Wait, oh, so I feel like I'm bonding now that everybody... I know that everybody else hates him. What girl? What girl? She had blue hair, dressed like a punk. Oh, that one, yeah. She's been following me around for eight hours now. I asked something to do, shits and giggles. Anything unusual? Do you notice anything unusual about the vortex? Oh, get those drums, guys. Come on, get on get with it. Get on it. I'm glad for the job, but I think Principal Wells should have cancelled the party. Yeah, me too. Considering it's like a Halloween dead theme, like skeletons, red lights, hell, all that. Honest, and you bust your ass for Blackwell. I hope everything turns out your way in the end. Until the tornado comes. <laughs> Fucking Rick and Morty. Hey, and then a giant tornado came. Okay. Uh, no, I'm actually not okay. I... Yeah, I dug up a dead body today. Nathan. Tends to fuck things up for you. Hell no. This is homework, not a party. I'll text you if I spy him. Good fuck luck. yeah. I'm gonna throw some dice. 
I just want to rip off Taylor's clothes with my teeth. I'm being in character though, this is not me, it's not Scotty talking, it's a character, it's a bit... Yeah. Ooh, what's so blurry in here? Whee! Oh, there's a pool! This is so wrong. <laughs> Two dead girls from the same school. I feel like pulling the plug. <laughs> what's going on here? I'm shutting this party down. Oh yeah, am I gonna get copyrighted again? That's okay, great. We'll work, guys. Turning the music off. Ooh, 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 hello. Alright. Max, you're so awkward. This is what happens to me when I'm in any party with a rhythmic ceremony or ritual. I just wanna walking through it like this. One of my earliest memories, and I've I haven't really had an excuse to share this with you guys at any point. I guess this is a semi relevant opportunity. In you go, Fatty. <laughs> Um, yeah, one of my earliest memories is going to the Royal Show, and as we were coming in the gate, uh, me, my dad, and my two sisters, well, two of my sisters, I should say, and there was very loud music playing, and I was deliberately trying to walk out of rhythm with it, because I felt daggy if I accidentally walked in rhythm with it. Just an early memory. Victoria's a cunt. Your head's too fucking big for your shoulders, woman. You listen. Courtney is supposed to be the VIP gatekeeper, not me. So please go. Ah, shit. Now what do I do? I need to find a way to enter this bullshit apartment. I'll kick the door in. <laughs> well, this isn't the club? <laughs> oh, okay. I thought it might have been too easy. Wait, what's going on? Wow. Getting pretty serious. Hey, where'd my friend go? Hello? Can you please hurl and flush already? Yes! Have you Somebody's been either having before? sex or throwing up. Mm. Or both. Ugh, Max. Should I be in here? This is our last Vortex Club party! Oh no. These all look like pretty nondescript sort of NPC typey people, so. Bouncer, fuck you! I'm going in. Why is he so big? How did he get so big? I'm so not impressed by this VIP crap. Right, so I can actually. Well, uh... well, I don't know what I'm doing. How am I supposed to get in there? Let me in, you cow. But I, I really want to. Alright, fine. Fuck you then. It would mean a lot to my self worth if you just let me in. Alright. Sorry. <laughs> Sorry about that. Bye bye. Oh, right, yeah. Well, go fuck yourself. I've saved you twice in this game, and, um,. You didn't show the proper gratitude. Oi! Let me in the fucking room. Whoa. How have I never met you? Catching a real big fish. I'm not in the Vortex Club? Oh, come on, guys. Come on, how can, how can you turn me down? How can you cut my head? Ugh. Right. You fucking cold hard bitch. Alright, looks like I'm not going to be getting any help from her. Aha. What, so I have to bribe my way in with alcohol? Is that it? Oh, Brooke and Daniel, what are you two doing here? Why does everyone say that? I'm here, aren't I? That light behind me looks like a giant lollipop. Yeah, nice jumper. Yeah, me too. Me too, bro. We can blonde. We can blonde. We can bond. Yeah. 
drive-in date? Oh, wow. Four episodes in and they're still obsessed with a fucking drive-in. I'm getting old, guys. You are a Miyazaki exhibition. Look at you. Yeah, heavy stuff, man. Real deep. Yeah, well, you know, I'm a Time Lord. Well, if I could fly that blonde idiot, it would be, uh... Well, she wouldn't be dead. God. Sorry, guys. I've got to get it together. I've got to focus on this game. I know I can win this shit. Get over yourself, Lucy Chen. <laughs> Is that her name? Alright, very nice. Hey, Daniel! I regret giving you a pep talk. Yeah, I found a dead body before. It's nothing. Just residue from that person we dug up. Did we finish digging her up and did we call the cops or did we leave her out there in the junkyard? I feel like as soon as you find a friend dead, it's sort of incumbent upon you to do something about it immediately. Like, you can't just leave them there, rotting for another week. Thanks, man! I'm gonna do my best, Holmes! God, he blows. Alright, see, I would just like to see, see, this game's been trying to shove me and Chloe together. I like games where you have a bit of freedom. To pick who it is you want to be with. And, uh, just, just blue sky this one for me. I mean, I think, you know, I think Max and this little filly here would be a, a good fit. They, they look like they'd get along. There's two. Look at this. I did the motion capture for this girl, actually. Yeah, anyway, enough of that. <sighs> Damn. Um, that's why I don't go to parties. Um,. Alright, so there's actually very little I can do except for, like what I joked about before, was pull the power and fuck their party up. Aha! Push! Yeah, fuck shit up. Yeah, fuck it! It's going in! It's going in, boys! <laughs> you stop the music! I win! I shut down the party. That's me, guys. Shouldn't that have zapped somebody? It's a lot of power in the thing. Go yeah, fuck yourself. Oh. We're gonna push it back in again? Oh, hang on. Oh, okay, so the idea wasn't to... No, I was gonna say, wouldn't that electrocute everyone in the fucking... Pool. Me chucking the big speaker in them? There's a lot of wattage in these things. Plenty of power. Ooh. Speaking of power. Wow. Nathan is the Vortex Club. So his ass has to be here tonight. Well. Hey. Oh, that makes me want to pull a carry on the Vortex Club. I'm gonna sit my ass down and wait for the jerk off jerk man jerk off to appear. Kate dead. Rachel dead. Enter the Vortex Club. Oh, don't worry, Max. It ends tonight. Look at these entitled assholes. They don't give a shit about anybody. They will. That tornado came right now. And then a giant tornado came. I've got the sound bite. I can just... But I have to make sure Chloe doesn't go on her own. I don't know, guys. I think I do anyway. I hate feeling this way. It's dark and angry. Here we go. And then a giant tornado came. <laughs> yeah. Space, get up. Oh, right. Am I done stalking these people? You guys are all losers. Yeah, yeah. 
Don't touch me! What famous person does she look like with that haircut? She looks like every actor actress who goes to that clueless phase where they have the short hair. And by clueless, I don't mean the film. I mean clueless is in, you know. Nathan. Wow. Some humanity. Awesome. <laughs> well, you got Nathan busted out of Blackwell, so you should be happy. And I'm the only person here who cares what Nathan is going through. This is wow. bigger than a problem. He's a murderer, you do not. I'm not perfect, okay? I'm a teenager at an art school. I'm only here to become a photographer and get famous. Jefferson. <laughs> is that what you were trying to tell Mr. Jefferson last night? Ooh. Uh, you saw me talking to him? The whole world so saw it. Everyone. We were just talking about how excited he is for the everyday hero. That's not how I recall it. You were making fun of my work. I'm going to win or anything. I hope you win fair. We'll see. And Max, I know you don't like me either, so it's not like we I never said I didn't like you. <sighs> Wasn't really Why the hell not? We're both into art and photography, we're both kinda of weird and pretentious. Yeah, but she's a class A cunt though. It's not a nice word, but I mean, let's be honest. I'm gonna have it on drink <laughs> now. Well, it's too late. It's too late for that. In this little vortex, huh? I actually hope so. I'm just taking the piss out of this. Why do you say it like that? The dark room. Listen to me. Your life is in serious danger. I know Nathan is your friend, but he is truly unstable and dangerous. He did drug Kate at that party so he could take her from this dark. What? Nice try, Max, but I don't believe you. I better get more convincing. Why didn't I take some evidence? That I don't know, but it was enough to make Kate want to die. Come on, fill in the blanks here. It's crazy. Is like one of my best this friends. girl's gonna get herself yes, killed. He takes serious meds, but that's not his fault. His family treats him like a total freak just because he has little melt -ups. They're not little anymore. They're deadly. He just he had to kill a lot of people. American Psycho. You have to believe me. You could have been a major bitch to me when I got hit with that paint. Well, the paint was my fault. Max, I don't hate you. I actually think you're one of the coolest people I've lost. Then why are you always treating me like shit? But cool. You just don't know it yet. Maybe I'm jealous because you don't give a shit what anybody thinks. And I do. Yeah. To be honest, Nathan has been freaking me out lately. Good, I'm glad we've made this breakthrough. Just make sure you stay away from him. And stick close to your friends tonight. Okay, thanks, Max. I'm just gonna finish this huge drink. <laughs> well, I don't feel so well. Seriously, I mean, look, this isn't good enough. She's gonna get fucking murdered. Thanks This game's making me antsy. Then you be careful too. I've got my own protection. Um Yeah, speaking of which, where the fuck is she? Where the hell did Chloe go? Thanks for She's gonna wind up in the ground in the ground next. They're all uh, all these girls are gonna get fucking dead. Oh they thank fuck she's not dead yet. Yeah. Boy am I glad to see you. Maybe there's hope yet for Victoria and me. What? I'm glad I warned her. What are we done? Chloe, Nathan isn't here. Nobody has seen him tonight. Oh crap! Jefferson. Maybe he's hiding in his dorm. Then let's bail. Nathan can't hide in there. Where are you going, ladies? Hey, Mr. Jefferson. Uh, are you both okay? You look like you're on a mission. Oh, uh, this guy's a creep. This is where it all unfolds. This is where it comes. Comes to light that Jefferson's the linchpin of this whole murder plot. I haven't seen him since this afternoon. He, he seemed pretty upset. I think he's still quite upset over uh, the whole. Yeah, keep playing dumb. Yeah. I know your game, Jefferson. Let's talk later, Max. I have to announce the winner of the contest. Oh, 
going on. Yeah, well. Fuck your portfolio. I know you will. Thanks. I hope so. Okay, excuse me. I'm almost gone. Get the hell out of here, Matt. Shit, what a creep. Okay, okay. Oh. MC douchebag on stage, everybody. Thank you. I appreciate it. I don't want to get in the way of the party, but it's time to announce the winner of the Everyday Heroes Contest. Well, I'm actually kind of tense with this. Who, who could it be? Everybody, get in the pool! Now this is the most important step in being an artist. Sharing your work with the world. What the fuck's about to happen? All of you represent Blackwell Academy. And everything is he gonna get shot? <laughs> as far as I'm concerned, you're all everyday heroes. Boom. Hello, please. And <laughs> drum roll. Oh, I just spat on the screen again. God, I've got really. It's good. What a shocker. Victoria Chase. What a bitch. I'm so surprised. Now would be a really, really good time to push the amp into the pool. Wow, he's abolished slavery and held to win a photography prize all in one. Yeah. And fame. I also want to thank all the students for being so dedicated in their pursuit. The students. And I'd like to dedicate this prize to the memory of Kate Marsh. She helped me make it happen. She was the real everyday hero of Blackwell. Wow. Thank you. Wow. Bitches to the end. I can. Yeah, are we gonna do this or what? Come on. This episode feels way longer than the other ones. I feel like once I get the video together, it's gonna that's gonna bear out. I'm gonna go back to making ten minute videos. This is a any evidence left after he's done. Oh shit. Shit. We have to go to the junkyard. No! Right Bad idea. Oh god, these girls, their ideas get worse every time they make a decision. Now they're gonna rush out to the junkyard with no backup. At least get the principal on board. You young ladies, you don't even know what you're getting yourselves into. Let me help Stop you. Stomping around, Chloe. I like it when she stomps. Just get ready to use your rewind fast if you can trust it jump us. Oh shit. What if he jumps me and then I can't use my rewind? You ever think of that? Wow. Yeah, he's gonna jump me first because I'm the one with the time powers. Oh shit. This game's getting fucking spooky. I should turn my bedroom light off. Could we get into the. So where's the body buried? Oh. So creepy out here. Sorry, Rachel. Where's the fucking body? Don't you're gonna suffer, Nathan. Ah! Fucking hell. Alright. Just an empty hole in the ground. Rachel. Rachel. He beat us to it. See, you should have fucking called the cops. I mean, like, okay, he owns the police in this town. But once it comes to a murder investigation, it's 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 going to be different. Is she still down there? Oh God, Max, look. She's still there. What are you doing? Don't look, Chloe. Um. Oh, no. oh crap. Oh shit. What the fuck? Oh shit. On oh, no. oh she took one in the head. I think at least. Or was that just a bit of blood on her head? From oh. Time jump to the thing. Oh no. 
Oh shit! Oh, I thought that was Chloe moving for a minute. I'm like, yeah, fuck off. Oh, I knew it! I knew he was in this up to his elbows! Oh, fuck that bastard! I mean, I'm not surprised, but like... Shit! Now I want to play the... See, I want to play the fifth one, but it's two in the morning, so... I can't really be here shouting at the computer anymore. Oh, man! And then the only way I'm ever going to get Chloe back is if I have another one of those special time Polaroids where I can, like, go back in history as opposed to, like, two minutes ago. Because I can't do the short-term jump because I just got needled. And... Yeah, well, I can't do that. But I'm probably going to wind up in some fucking dungeon. How the hell am I going to get out of this one? And when does the tornado fit in? Damn it. So many questions, guys. And everybody else knows already because they all played it. Like, as it was coming out. And then when, it, when the fifth episode came out, they were all like, Oh, I'm jumping straight on Steam. I'm going to play it and download it within like half an hour because my internet's so fast. I'm struggling here with my broken Australian internet. God damn it. The world is fucked. Oh man, this game. Oh, you know, I've been hating on Chloe the whole time, but damn it. Now she took a bullet in the head. I feel a bit uh, responsible. I feel a bit mean. Oh. And everyone's asleep. I can't even share these developments with anybody. Kind of sucks, really. I guess David's already gone to sleep since he's got to work in the morning. So we're just here. I can't even write to anybody about this because I don't really speak to anybody who plays the game. I mean, I, I, you know, I've known a couple of people who have, but uh, as opposed to actually currently talking to, no, not really. Oh. Is there going to be a next time on uh, Life is Strange thing? I feel like there has been in previous uh, episodes. Oh, making available to the public on networks are forbidden. Is, is that what I'm doing here? Fuck. I hadn't thought of the implications. Damn, this fucking... Oh, fuck. See, look, I... Did I not say that going out to the junkyard was a dumb idea? And that relying on me to do my time jumps was a dumb idea because if I get taken out first, there's nothing I can do. He's letting this nut job Chloe run the operation. Now we're fucked. Even Warren, if we'd taken Warren, they would have attacked him first because, you know, he's an idiot. <laughs> You're a lumbering dolt. He just would have gone, because, you know, it's obvious he'd get himself rubbed out before us because, you know. Oh, cool. I refused. Chloe's request. Wow, more people accepted it. But I'm going to assume that my theory is correct and that, like, you can just go in the Polaroid anyway. All it really does is put you through an inconsequential, heartbreaking scene before you go back in time and fix everything. Most people didn't let Nathan get the shit beaten out of him. Chloe wounded Frank. No one got hurt. 71%? What? What's with you guys? Victoria believed your warning. It's because I'm a, I'm a persuasive person. What blue jay? What? When did that happen? Huh. Bird's nest. What bird's nest? <laughs> Got David's files. And that. Okay, well I used to walk through, so... Okay, didn't help you. dip a dip a dip dip a dip a dip I didn't figure out Nathan's been going. You didn't help a little. Yeah, well, that's not really. Who cares if her, right? Oh, oh! I knew it was that Jefferson cunt. I just knew it. It was so obvious, by the way, that he was in none of the. Th virtually none of the uh, episodes. Oh, fuck. Oh, fuck.
All of a sudden, the tornado seems like a dear old friend that I'm happy to see. Wow. If I'm affected by any of the content in life... <laughs> yeah. I feel like that's the kind of thing they have to put on this game. Considering the target audience and all that. Oh, look at this. I really do blend in with all the Polaroids, don't I? Wow, guys. Um... Oh, the menu changes now because I'm on the last episode. It's all... Wow. Quit game. Yeah. Um... Wow. Well, guys, I guess I'll play the fifth one whenever I can. Um... Just gonna unwind now and take it easy, so... You do the same thing, guys. Come wherever you like. Alright. Just make sure it's on my big boots. Whoa, what the hell's this? What the fuck?